It's a me, Mario. Oh boy. It used to be that if you wanted to play Mario Kart in virtual reality, you had to go to Japan or the UK. Well, not anymore. Now those of you in the US can experience the joy of strapping on an HTC Vive headset, sitting in a tiny fake car and pretending to throw red shells at your friends more easily. You'll just need to find your way to um, Union Station in Washington DC. And we're being serious here. You actually need to go to a train station slash mall hybrid to pretend to drive a go-kart. Let's just put that absurdity aside for a second. Mario Kart Arcade GP VR is arguably the best way to get your multiplayer virtual karting fix. You can careen around classic courses as Mario, Peach, Luigi, or Toad, and the vibe trackers you wear on your gloves mean you can chuck bananas at your rivals or smash them with hammers. I haven't tried it myself, but Engadget Chinese Editor-in-Chief Richard Lai took the game for a spin in Tokyo, and it kinda sounds like he loves it. Of course, you don't need to take his word for it. Just get yourself to Union Station before March 9th. And don't worry, if Mario Kart does happen to get old quick, just know that it's one of three titles Bandai Namco is showing off at its new VR Zone portal in DC. If you really wanted to, you could also put in some time with a pretty awesome looking mech combat sim called Argyle Shift, or with Ski Rodeo, a game whose name probably says it all. A brief stint in each game will set you back $8, which, Obviously, it doesn't include the cost of the Amtrak ticket us out-of-towners will need to get to Union Station in the first place. Whew. We'll see you tomorrow with more Engadget Today.